Yeah, the biggest star tonight. Um, the commentators, you're saying, were just asking themselves up there. You reckon he'll be happy with that? So I'll ask you. Are you happy with what you just did? Yeah, definitely. Uh, I think I made some slight mistakes, but I, I assume uh, it's my first proper game with the, with the first team. So I'm, I'm just happy that I, I got a chance and I'm proud of myself. How special, and given all the special things you've done in your athletics career and your sporting career, how special a moment was that for you, scoring that first goal? <laughs> it, was, it, was, it was a big deal. I think uh, scoring a, a goal uh, in your first proper match, it, it's a big deal. Your first start and scoring two goals, is, it was a good feeling, you know what I mean? Because this is what I work towards. I, I try to improve myself. I try to get better, and I'm on the way in, in doing that. And that second one, it was, it was the, <laughs> the tap in. And then yeah. as soon as you scored, I saw you look over and you went, five more, coach, five more, because you knew the 70 was coming up yeah. and you, you might have only had a minute. Yeah, we, we, yeah, we were talking, they said they'd give me 15 to 20 minutes more, so I was like, you know what, give me five more minutes, let's see what happens, because I think we picked the pace up in the second half, so I was just hoping I'll get a little bit more going. How were you going in the first half? Because you, you, you had, and it happens for a striker sometimes in a game, one minute in, bang, you've got an opportunity, and then all of a sudden it's gone, you don't know when the next one's coming. How did how did you deal with that uh, up in your head? For me, the, uh, the coach said to me, listen, you will get chances, you'll, you'll miss some, you'll score some, just don't hold your head down, keep your head up and, and try for the next one. So I, I was surprised. He caught me on surprise, and I just, I just panicked a little bit. Uh, it, it's the first couple of minutes, so I panicked, and I, I, I overhit the ball. But as you said, you, you learn. The more you play, the more you learn, and you, you get more uh, uh, accustomed to the game. How comfortable have you been feeling with everything that you've been putting in, in terms of the one-on-one -on -one sessions, the individual sessions you're doing, and with the team as well? It, like, week to week, is it getting more comfortable as yeah. it goes on? Yeah, definitely. I'm, I'm learning a lot. Uh, I've picked up a lot of things, uh, simple things, and I always think I feel like the simple things are the ones that really matter because I watch football, so I understand the movement, but the simple things like locking my ankles, uh, getting to space, uh, pulling defenders away, stuff like that. So I've, I've learned a lot, and I've been improving quickly, I personally feel, so I'm just happy I could come out here and prove myself there and show the world that I'm improving. What is the biggest thing you reckon you've improved on and what Conversely, what's the biggest thing you need to still improve? I think uh, I think I've improved in every year. You know what I mean. I think my touch is, is a little bit better. Uh, my vision it needs to improve a little bit more. Uh, my running, I think running off the ball is is where I've improved the most. Uh, I can see and move into space. Uh, but there's a lot more to learn. You know what I mean. I just got to continue learning and getting better. That's all I can do. You enjoying the coast? I mean, we're still waiting for summer as we stand here. It's freezing cold. You wouldn't have expected this in October here. Yeah, uh, I'm just waiting. You know what I mean. They say it's going to be hot when it comes, so I'm looking forward. <laughs> and uh, watching in all hours of the night, watching you watching go through the pain of Manchester United at the moment, that must be fun. Yeah, it's no fun, but uh, it's a part of football. You win some, you lose some. Uh, but uh, they showed heart the last game, and I'm very proud of that. I'm happy, and uh, I just got to continue supporting them because I'm a direct in Manchester United fan, so I'll keep supporting them. One last one, the, the time frame for you. What, what exists now in the next few weeks or months? What are you giving it? Well, now we got to, the discussion comes up now because the season starts next week, so now we have to sit down with the coach and the management staff and figure out how we go forward, what's the plan, if they're going to sign me or I need to do more or what so. So I'm just waiting on that and I'll be okay. And you're keen as to be a Mariner, no doubt. Yeah, I'm, I'm keen. That's why I'm here to play my best and to try to get into the team. Appreciate your time, mate. Well done tonight. All Two right. goals, huh? Okay. Thank you very much.